welcome to Metro Exodus. Let's start a new game. I've tried this a couple of times and they haven't really worked out. There's always been some problems with the capture or with uh, save files disappearing or something. And, well, let's go through this. 1080p only, because of my crappy monitor. Nothing interesting here. I don't know which way this DLSS should be, but I guess balanced is pretty balanced. I could go for quality. I guess quality is better than balance. Yeah, let's go quality. VRS, I have no idea what it is. And that's about it for that. Uh, okay, let's change that. Um, game options. Nothing weird there. What is accessibility? Subtitles? No, that's not it. Oh, it's this thing. Yeah, QT control is important. I don't wish to tap like an whatever. Gamma, that's it. Well, I don't know, because my second screen, I don't see that radiation mark. But I kind of see it on this main monitor. But YouTube will probably darken it even more. So let's just keep it there. There. Yeah. It's good enough. And I guess we're off to a start. I even have two slots. Both of them from today. Hardcore and Ranger Hardcore. What the hell? Well. But, as I considered, not to make it a suffering simulator. I'll try rather just to have fun. Regular FPS players. I guess there's still a challenge. A uh, Ranger Hardcore thing would be great because there's no hot element thingies. But I guess they might be useful. So let's go with normal. I still remember life before the war. I remember that we used to be different. We used to live up there, on the surface. We used to be the masters of the whole world. We built gigantic cities of glass and steel. We crossed the oceans at will. And we also conquered the skies. There used to be seven billion of us. We were not born for life in the tunnels. I was born to breathe fresh air, and I remember it. The seven billion were wiped out by the last war. Only 50,000 managed to survive underground, with the surface poisoned, burned, and teeming with horrible monsters. One day, the radiation on the surface might subside, and our grandchildren, or their grandchildren, might be able to return there. At least that's what my brothers in arms from the Order believe. Basically, there was no hope for us right off the start. Still, we humans are just too bad at surrendering. We tried to make the best of what we had, banded together, and worked to make the Metro our new home. 
After all, it might well be the only place left on Earth for humans to live. For a time, we thought we could make it. But, regrettably, the war didn't kill our bad habits. In the relative safety of the tunnels, corruption festered. And when danger came from above the ground, only a few of us stood against it, our numbers dwindling by the day. But I remember we were born for a better life, and I can't accept that I'm destined to grow old and die underground. I don't care if I'm called an idiot. But if even a single shard of the old world still exists out there, I have to find it. Between endless years of hopeless existence and even a single moment of hope, I must choose hope. I must find that signal. <laughs> 